Hi guys, it's May 4th and I'm in the middle of prepping for Weston's party right now. Um, it's not till Saturday, um, the 8th, but I feel like I just like have a lot in my head that I need to get done and so the sooner I start the better. Um, I've already started prepping um, his cake. I've done three trials and errors, <laughs> um, or three trials, two were errors, and one is looking okay. I'll show you in a second. Um, I was messing with it all day yesterday, and I just wanna get the cake right, and I'm using, hi, sweet boy, what's wrong? Hang on. What's up, baby? Hi, my love, yeah. I'm talking about your party. I'm talking about your party. Here, you want me to hold you? Okay. Okay, you wanna look too? You wanna look too? There we go. He just got up from a nap. But what I was saying is his cake, like I'm trying to get it right, and I'm baking it at home. I didn't order a cake. I was kind of like, excited for the challenge. Um, I enjoy baking, but I've never worked with fondant or anything crazy like that. So I made his cake, it's four layers. I used green fondant, white fondant. It's not done, I need to finish it and put like um, the extra little touches and decorations on it. And I am gonna make cupcakes still for the day of um, and a smash cake for him. So there's still a lot to do. Um, I have a few days to get things done, but like friends and family are flying in for his birthday. It's gonna be a huge ordeal. Oh, excuse you, burpee. Excuse you, that was a big old burp. Friends and family are coming for your first birthday, you know? Are you trying to burp now? <laughs> so, he's almost one. Um, I'll show you. <laughs> Look at those teeth. He has another tooth coming in too. He has four and then one right here on the side that's kind of just coming in. So here's what I'm working on right now is this little sign. I'm gonna be putting this over where the desserts go. Um, so it took forever to pick out the letters, but here we go. I was either gonna say Weston turns uno or Weston's first fiesta. Um, I was just seeing what I had enough letters for. So I am gonna do Weston's first fiesta. And then, um, oh, here's like the fondant that I've been working with and messing with. Here's some cutouts. I did these yesterday, so they might be too dry to actually like use now, um, but they're gonna go on the cake. This set, um, I don't think I shared this in my party prep video. Maybe I did, I don't remember. A cake decorating kit supply. I bought these um, at Hobby Lobby, cause I'm gonna add, that's how I made the cutouts here. And then a little bit of a disaster going on, but these are gonna go on the cupcakes that I'm gonna make. Um, there's all the balloons, need to work on that. There's balloon arch, so um, anyways, this was just kind of me sorting out what I had. Um, and then I wanna do a banner here. The tacos are gonna be here, like taco bar, so I might wanna hang a banner that says taco bar, like right here. Um, let's look over here, buddy. And then in here are decorations I've been working on. So the bar I'm really excited about. Um, I'm gonna have to pick him up because he's gonna cry when I go in there. Okay, so like I was saying, here's the bar. It's pretty much done except for a couple more things I need to put on here. I'm borrowing a margarita machine from a friend, so if it fits on here, um, I'll put that on here somewhere as well. And then over here, I already stuffed the pinata with um, candy. It's so small, I just really like stuffed it to the brim. And these are candy bags for the kids to grab candy. Um, I have maracas coming also as like a party favor for the kids. Um, taco bar. So when this came on Amazon, it was just like the gold letter with the cactus and I added some card paper behind it um, and then stuck one of these little cupcake hat things. Like this one, same thing. It was kind of chintzy so I added um, the paper and glued these little guys on there too. And then back here, I've been working 
on you know getting the food and drinks um i did a little mock-up for the dessert table and it's gonna be um i'm gonna have like cupcakes on this little stand i got utensils or this cool utensil container thing at um home goods um this little llama this was from the target dollar section i have two of them and i didn't know like what to do with it but we got these little toothpick things when I went with my mom to Hobby Lobby the other day. And the little jar come, came with fits perfectly in the back of the llama. So, like, that's super cute. Um, this will, we're going to have an Uno tournament. So, if you saw this, this there's going to be a dollar buy in for Uno. And so, all the cash is going to go in here. Whoever wins will get the cash, plus, like, this funny little cup that we found at Hobby Lobby as well. And then this will be full with, I'll probably put waters in there so it's easy for kids to grab. And then when people walk in, I'm gonna have a little sanitation station here um, with sanitizer. I'm gonna make a cute sign, um, just, I don't know, it'll say, please sanitize or, you know, something friendly. And I was thinking this banner I might hang here um on the ceiling when people walk in so it's just kind of like when you first walk in you get a fun touch of fiesta okay so here's how the cake is looking so far um i did this last night i baked funfetti just out of a box and then i did my best to cover it with two different kinds of fondant it was already colored um i just got like this boxed fondant right here um so the inside, like I said, is just boxed funfetti cake, just the regular kind, and then I frosted it and then rolled out the fondant and covered each layer and stacked it. And I mean, it's definitely not perfect. Like look at all these crazy little, you know, welts and stuff, but I'm gonna do my best to cover it up with some cute cactus. Um, I'm cutting them right now and then I just mixed up um, some funfetti frosting, just the vanilla, um, and I added yellow to it. I think I might do like, um, I'm getting ready to fill my cake pipe here from that kit that I got on Amazon. I'm not totally sure. I think I might just do like a border of yellow through here to hide as much as I can and then stick the cactus on. I don't know, I'm not completely sure yet. I'm just gonna kind of wing it and hope for the best.